Hi, and thanks for logging on to the Daily Dvar Halacha. And here's a brand new Halacha for you, and it's for Thursday, the 7th day of January. Here we go. A couple of more laws about Shech Yanu on brand new items. If you get a new suit, then it would be appropriate to say a Shech Yanu on that new suit if it brings you a lot of joy. But you should only say the Shech Yanu after that suit is fully tailored and ready to be worn. If you just bought it and you like it, but it's still needs to be tailored and you're not wearing it yet, then that's not yet the appropriate time to be saying Shechiano on that brand new suit. Also, you know that when you get a new suit, it should be taken for shotness testing to make sure that there isn't any wool and linen sewn together into that uh, garment. And until the shotness testing is done, you don't really know if the suit is like good to go, and therefore you should not be saying the Shechiano bracha yet until after it passes its shotness testing, or if the Fail the test, but the shotness has been fixed and taken out of the garment. Otherwise, if there's wool and linen together in that garment, which you're not allowed to wear, of course, then you cannot be saying Shechianu yet. Let's say you forgot to say Shechianu the first time you wore that suit. Can you say it the second time you wear it? So the answer is yes, if you're still f- experiencing joy on the second time that you're wearing it. If you get a hand-me-down from your older sibling, and when it comes to you, is like joy to you, a little bit of joy, that you just got that hand-me-down and now it's yours to wear. So that's not the kind of thing that gets a shechianu bracha because it's a hand-me-down. If you receive a present from someone, then yes, you do say shechianu on that brand new item for the joy of getting that new item, if there is joy in getting that brand new item. If you have two garments at the same time, two suits, you know, and you they both need a shechianu, you could say the shechianu on one that you're wearing and think of the other at the time also and have that count for both of them and that would be okay. Some say that you're supposed to say the bracha of malbish arumim. That's the one where you bless God for clothing us. Um, and so some people say it's appropriate to say that bracha when you get a new suit. Others say no that only the Shechianu was the appropriate bracha. So, what uh, a good way to accomplish both is to put on the new suit in the morning, and when you're saying the bracha malbish arumim in the morning, you think that it should be applying besides the usual, that you thank God for giving us clothes. You're thanking God for giving you this brand new beautiful suit that you're wearing and thinking about while you're saying the bracha malbish arumim. Um, if a person says the bracha malbish arumim on a certain suit or something like that, he's still eligible to say the shechayanu bracha on top of that. It doesn't like kind of wipe away the need. Uh, you can still say the shechayanu bracha afterwards. Thanks for logging on and log on again tomorrow for more. Bye bye.